Hello friends and welcome back to another video. In today's video we are going to be doing Raps TBR Chooses What I Read for the Week. So in today's video we are going to be choosing one, two, three, however many depending on how big the books are. Um, and we are going to read them because I am going on a book buying ban and I cannot buy books until I read all of these. So I am also filming a TikTok because I'm going to be doing like a TikTok uh, uh, video, like I'm going to be doing TikTok versions of it on my TikTok, so English, Haley. So I've got my TikTok going right here, so I'm going to film myself both kill birds with one, kill two birds with one stone. Anyway, so let's go. I'm going to start the TikTok and we're going to choose. I am so nervous. <laughs> All right, let's get a good one. We'll do a yellow one. So we have number 149. All right, 149, where is that gonna be? Right here. All right, so we have book number 149. All right, you know what he does. He says I saw the straight edges. It is the house in the Cerulean Sea. Oh, I'm so excited. All right. Oh my gosh. I'm excited for this one. Oh, I'm excited for this one. So, here we go. First of our wrap TBR. I gotta go find some tabs. I'm excited about this. update because we're getting ready to leave but I'm about 30% of the way into um, House in the Cerulean Sea. I am loving it. Yes ma'am. It's okay. We can close the door. Um, and I am predicting that it is going to be a six star read. It is so freaking good. Um, I am loving it so far. I cannot believe it. I have not read it before now. All right, so we're about to head out. I will update you more this afternoon when we get back, but that is my really, 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 really quick update. All right, I'm gonna hurry. My battery's blinking at me. It is a couple days later, but we finished our first book, House in the Cerulean Sea. It was so good, five stars. Oh my goodness, it was cute and cozy. And the kids, oh my gosh, the kids were my favorite part. They were so freaking cute. There were so many times that I was smiling and laughing out loud. Oh such excitement but yes so we need to um make our second draw so i'm gonna put the battery on to charge for just a few minutes and then we will do so um so let me charge my battery for just a few minutes and then we will do our second draw to see what we're reading next welcome back it is time to pick our next pick for our wrapped tbr hopefully it is a good one See, purple's my favorite color, so we'll go for a purple. Let's go for this one. Purple, my favorite color, too. <gasps> one, 102. This is on the shelf behind me. Oh, she thick. She, she is thick. She, oh no, I know what this is because I see it through the paper. And that's okay. I just finished the Zodiac Academy, so this will be perfect. All right, come back and see how this one is. Jump scare. Good morning, friends. Ignore the hair, it is hair washing day, but I just finished Never keep. And um, while this is set in the same world as Zodiac Academy, you're following completely new characters. It is a completely new plot. And um, 
you do not have to read Zodiac Academy to be able to read this. And it is, this first book at least is, is focusing more heavily on like the fantasy aspects where I know as the Twisted Sisters, usually they focus heavily on the romance. But with this one, um, it is heavily, 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 heavily um, fantasy um, focused. And that ending, the Twisted Sisters did it again. Um, I cannot wait for the second one. I think the second one comes out in April. Um, so really good read. I gave it four stars. Um, so in this one, we are following Everest and Vesper. Everest is, um, she is part of the Air Wilders and Vet, no, she is part of the Water Wilders. Vesper is part of the Air Wilders. And Never Keep is this, like, military academy that they go to for six months to kind of train and everything and be ready because all of the elements are separated at this point. Um, you have the Stone Forgers, the, re the, the, I forget what they call them, but the Pyros, uh, um, so all the elements are separated and they are all at war with each other and they all go to never keep to train they are not allowed to kill each other at never keep but they go and they train to get ready to be put into this war and we are following our two main characters as they enter never keep to train and things like that we find out some secrets along the way um, so really good. It was entertaining. Um, I did find myself bored some, but you know, it's a Twisted Sisters novel. You know, they are going to put some fluff in there that is not needed. But once I know that once you grow to love the characters, you love you love the fluff. Cause I know with the Zodiac Academy, I like these the characters became like friends to me. So. I didn't care about the fluff because it was like my friend just catching me up on their day. So yeah, but anyway, we need to go and draw for a new book. All right, friends, it is time. Let's see, can I squish myself down a little bit so you can see my face? Um, we need to pick our next um, wrapped TBR book. So um, as always, I have TikTok going right here because I am filming at the same time. Um, and we are going to pick. So let me get the TikTok going. So we've got a yellow and a purple. We have green, blue, and pink. Let's see, what am I feeling today? We'll do green. Oh, I don't know about that one. We'll do this one. Oh, I don't know. I am so scared. Um, this one feels good. We'll do this one. All right. Oh, we have number 47. So let's see. Okay. It's not as thick as our last one. It is a hardback. Let's see. <gasps> I was hoping to get, yes. So we have The Women by Kristen Hanna. All right, so we have The Women by Kristen Hanna. Um, I don't know if I'm prepared to cry, but I love, what was it? I love The Great Alone by her, so I'm really excited to see um, how this one is. I've heard a lot of great things. It has, it has really high ratings on Goodreads. So yeah, so let's get to reading. Hello friends, I'm coming at you live from the office. I'm supposed to have an appointment today, so I'm just waiting for them to come in. But I do have an update on the women. I am about 25% of the way in, and it is so good. I mean, right off the bat, we already had something emotional. And then um, there is a male character in the book that I really, really like, and then we find out something about him, and it just made me so upset because I really liked him. I don't want to give away too much because I don't want to spoil it, but so far it is so freaking good. Um, and a little update, I do need to start recording some of my December videos because I have eight videos instead of four that I want to push out in December. Um, I'm not quite at the point of doing Vlogmas because, um, just because I do have like, a, like I do have a job. Um, so I don't and kids and so I don't really have a lot of time to sit down and record 12 or 24 videos But I do want to do eight um, so um, My goal is to get all of those videoed next week when my kids go back to school um, 
so those will be coming out two a week in the month of december so i'll be looking forward to that but anyway yeah back to the women it's so freaking good but yeah i thought i would update you we're gonna do some more reading today but so far i am loving it Good morning friends and happy Thanksgiving. I just want to jump on here real quick because we have finished our last book of the video, The Women, and I am giving this five stars. I really enjoyed this. So we follow our main, okay, say hi. Say hi. Hi. Say, Thanksgiving. Say happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Um, so we follow our main character, Frankie, and we start off in the very beginning. Um, her brother goes off to war. He ends up dying, and she decides that she wants to enlist as a nurse. And we follow her story from there. And it is a story, a coming of age story, it's a story about love and loss. And we learn that what they kind of went over. I felt like I was reading war stories from a real person. Um, like it was that good. Like. Kristen Hannah is two for two for me. She's probably be gonna become, if not already, one of my favorite authors ever. Um, I've only read two of her books and I gave both of them five stars. So, thank you so much for watching. If you have not already subscribed, join my bookish community, it would make my day. And I will see you in my next one where um, we are probably, I don't know what's the next one gonna be, if it's gonna be the 24 hour readathon or what, but I am gonna be uploading two videos a week for the month of December. Um, I'm not quite, you know, in the spot where I can do Vlogmas, we're doing 12 or 24 videos straight for 12 or 24 days, but I am going to upload more. So anyway, thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one.